This tissue is not. The strength of paper is determined by the length and the strength of the fibers. Hi. Hi, we're collecting for the paper money. Oh, do you have a cold? can you make with paper? Airplanes. Paper airplanes. And that's how I met my sister. <laughs> Origami, um, paper toweling. You can make um, cards. Some cards are made of paper. And cardboard. Hi, Candice. How are you? Uh, my name's Takeyoshi. What's this? Uh, this is a paper crane made out of origami. Why is it called origami? Uh, it is called origami because ori means folding and gami means paper, so it's paper folding. Could you make me one? Sure. How long have you know how to do this? Um, I started around uh, grade two or three with the simplest ones. Is it hard to do? Uh, matters uh, matters what kind of a uh, design you're doing. Can you do this with any kind of paper? Um, usually I use a uh, square paper and any color you want. Did this begin in Japan? Um, yes, yes, uh, generally yes. Willie, and today I'm going to show you how to make some marbled paper. Let's see if we have everything we need. Vinegar, and a cup, and some paper, of course, some cooking oil, and some food coloring, a couple of different colors. And, oh yeah, some warm water. Now, before we start, we should probably cover the whole floor with some newspaper. Don't want to make a mess. Now, let's take the vinegar and pour it in the cup. We need, oh, just about a full cup. There we go. Vinegar down. Drop it in the water. Oh, doesn't look like there's anything different. Now we'll take the food coloring and the oil, put a, put a spoonful of oil, and mix it all up. Get it stirred up really well. There we go, nice blending. Let's add that to the water, see what happens now. 
mean. Boom! Hey, isn't that neat the way it sits on top of the water? Don't stir it up, just let it sit there. Okay, there, that should be enough green. Let's go back and get another color. Let's see, a little red. Okay, stir it all up. Right there. Okay, put in one spoonful. Okay, don't mix that, just let it sit there. Okay, put another bit. All right, there we go, how's that? Okay, let's get some blue now. That's the colors I'm using. You can use whatever colors you want. There's the blue. Now let's put one spoon in. Oh, that's neat. All right. Now let's put another one in. There we go. Okey-doke. Now we'll just go back, get a piece of paper, and without stirring the stuff, we'll slip the piece of paper in there and let the colors get on it. Oh, maybe I should move my head so you can see what's going on. There we go. Now, let's take it out, and we'll let it drip there for a second, and then we'll lay it down, and there we go. On the paper towel, we have marbled paper. Yeah, of course we sell newspapers. No, I mean, look at all these newspapers. Must be the afternoon edition. Guess you're gonna need some help delivering them, eh, partner? What have I got myself into? Willie here. Still wonder what choose a nest to make a home for a family to rest? The answer is a wasp nest. A wasp called the paper wasp makes a nest out of, you got it, paper. Well, I guess that wraps up our show for today. Remember, there is so much in this world to discover, so be curious, explore, and keep wondering. Why? Why do you keep on getting all the presents? Well, actually, Candace, this present was for you. Oh. Wonder where you can find reptiles. Wonder if reptiles really have cold blood. Wonder if dinosaurs were ferocious? Join us next week as we explore the wonder of reptiles. Teddy Ruxpin. Weekdays at 12.30 on ATV.